Well, hello there again, puzzle friends. We are here today with another video. This time, a, not again a puzzle haul, but I do believe we have um, enough for this here. Well, but then you never say never. But let's leave that for now and let's start seeing what we have. I do believe we have some interesting tiles. These ones are were quick to deliver and they were from another place so they were somewhat different or I tried to do to buy somewhat different but let's start because I'm already excited as you probably also are uh, this is um, Velcarte, a world map uh, it's actually not something special but I actually was not uh, sure what I was getting but then you know me, I do like world maps. The box is a little smaller as you can see. Uh, and they do have a poster inside. Which was which is a world map. I have made a world map, two world maps actually. Uh, but both of them were um, the hemispheres. So this one is just the map so it should be somewhat different for experience but we will never know until you will puzzle it uh, where brand is Moses uh, I actually never heard of this brand I don't know if they produce anything else um, I don't know the dimension of this there it's uh, it's 1000 pieces I do believe I read somewhere yeah the dimensions are somewhat the typical dimensions for European puzzles somewhat smaller than 50 times 70 centimeters. But let's carry on. Here is yet another jigsaw puzzle from uh, Ravensburger. I do be, we have two today from Ravensburger. This is the first one. It's from the series Exit Puzzle, where you actually puzzle this uh, picture, which is somewhat different from what you see in the box. And then you solve the clues to find the exit, so to say. I have puzzled already two of them. They are doing well on the channel. And they were very interesting, actually. Uh, this one is called the... How it's called? Uh, Atelier's... Artist Studio. This one is called Artist Studio. Uh, they have the name on many uh, languages. So I, I suppose you will uh, find what the rest on this portrait is. Not sure, but I have to puzzle it to see. Uh, it's very interesting. You can see many colors. You see a painting. Many colors here. Some uh, inventions. Somewhat of a Leonardo da Vinci um, artist studio. So let's see what else we have. This one, I thought it was kind of interesting. This one actually is a crossword puzzle uh, and a jigsaw puzzle. They do have this crossword in um, uh, inside as a paper, as a no, normal form, so to say. And uh, you are supposed to solve the crossword puzzle and then make the jigsaw puzzle. If we do, it, do this on this order or if we do this crossword at all, uh don't know we will see uh here is the crossword as you can see and here are the jigsaw puzzles the jigsaw puzzle pieces i always find it interesting i do believe it will be somewhat uh, difficult this to make but then again this sort of a challenge is a challenge i do like to take let's see the other jigsaw the other ravensburger it's 1000 pieces you may have seen this it's uh, actually hot so to say on the market now it's uh, as you can tell it's from Alice in Wonderlands in, uh, I don't know if it's inspired from uh, the Disney edition but it's probably from uh, Chuck Carroll's uh, um, book here you can see the, the cat that is laughing with his uh, 
uh, can you say, with this uh, bad, with this laugh that uh, the evil guys to have. The, the, I really like it. It's a really an atmosphere. This picture. I really like that the, these branches are actually like hands that are trying to grasp and take away Alice to another world. Here's the rabbit that was also in in the, in the book. The the caterpillar that had the optimal. Um, he was the perfect size, so to say. Uh, I I all say all this stuff from the book. I've, I've actually heard the book. Some birds. I don't. So I do believe it would be very very interesting to puzzle. So let's go to. Uh, let's carry on. So I did buy another Aquarius. Uh, in the last, uh, um, on the last, um, uh, actually uh, not in the last, um, before the last one, uh, before the last hole, I did an, an, another hole that it was two pieces, two jigsaw puzzles made from the brand Aquarius. This is the third one, and the last one for the time being. Also, at three thousand. Yeah, it's difficult to make three thousands because of the matters. That they're too big I have to make another setting for the camera and stuff like this and the, my table is not so big to fit them in uh, this is from the Lord of the Rings as you already tell uh, I like that it's a collage from famous scene, famous scenes that they are going the Nazgul's here is Gandalf with his stuff here are the the ring bearers so to say Frodo and Sam that they are <laughs> Actually, looking if uh, the place is free, I do believe they they saw some orcs from this place, and the golem that played a very important part, Saruman. Yeah, you know the all the characters if you are a Lord of the Rings fan. As it comes to me, I did enjoy the movies. I would not consider myself a Lord of the Rings fan, although I do enjoy the movies and I do enjoy a good fairy tale, so to say. Um, because to my eyes, Lord of the Rings is actually a fairy tale. So, 3000 pieces. The dimensions are big 82 centimeters times 115 centimeters, or if you are in the USA, 32 inches, 45 inches. It's uh, actually somewhat heavy, what's to expect it when you have 3000 pieces. Uh, and we have the another one This actually looks very nice. I didn't expect this to look very nice I did buy this because of the Sherlock Holmes. I'm a very big fan of Sherlock Holmes um, The box looks very interesting the illustration also and I do believe they have let's see if you can open this yes the jigsaw puzzle pieces look a ve of very good quality and they do have a poster inside with some text a poster inside with some text and here are the, the quality of the puzzle pieces uh, having seen another video on youtube from uh, a fellow youtuber he did also a jigsaw puzzle from jane austen um, and it was from the same brand he was very happy with the quality, he was very happy with the information that was inside. I will probably read all the information uh, that is inside on this paper and I will show it to you also when I do the puzzle. Maybe not all of the information, but some information of it so that you can also say if it's worth your money or not. But for me, as a um, uh, Sherlock Holmes fan, I do believe it is worth the money. This actually is uh, the fourth jigsaw puzzle that I have uh, with the name Sherlock Holmes. So, and this is the last one, last but not least. I was actually very inspired when I saw this. Uh, it's actually it's also from a brand that I don't know if I don't know if this it says Lego, but. 
you put Lego is the, the theme chroniclebooks.com uh, let's also open this uh, it's funny some of the jigsaw puzzles like this one they were not sealed they were not wrapped uh, do, do they do this to save uh, the plastic on on this also from zero homes was not wrapped to save the environment stuff like this I don't know but uh, actually it was not uh, damaged so it's a minor to me ah and they do have a bag that you can also close again this I have also seen uh, the pieces look somewhat different also not so like Ravensburger which the, if you put the glue on them or water they will take in uh, all in like a sponge they do seem like somewhat different more of a wood so to say but they are not wood uh, I'm, a vib I'm also a Lego fan because you can uh, also make a lot of stuff you can let your imagination free roam free you can build houses you can build everything autos many stuff like this I used to do some Lego Technic when I was younger they were what somewhat pricey but they are were a very good um, time spent with your money and this one I do like because it's somewhat it says rainbow bricks I do like this uh, that it's the colors are changing and it's something that you have a picture that actually shows something because there are somewhat some um, jigsaw puzzles that uh, they change colors or they are one color or something like this and they are a challenge and more, many people are excited to have them yes I will maybe do also a challenge or something like this but the final result is not something that you can look not something interesting this one would be interesting at least for my eyes I don't know what do you think about this this type of jigsaw puzzle so to say that was it for once today I do hope you like these six choco puzzles I do hope you like these puzzle holes um, feel free to write me in the comments if you want to ask something or if you want to comment on some jigsaw puzzle or something and will uh, I will do my best to get to answer to you that's it for me for today thanks again for watching happy puzzling stay safe until next time goodbye